Let's see if it's gonna tip. It is. Oh, it's going over. Uh-oh. Uh, we need to go because this is filling up super quick. Look at the water line just rising. Holy man. Why am I still watching this? That is crazy. Okay, time to run. <laughs> YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Sinking Ship Survival, and yes, folks, we're back once again, and today we're going to be checking out this massive cruise ship. So, what makes this cruise ship very special is the whole fact that it has a full interior. Now, I'll go ahead and point out the whole fact that it isn't a full-size cruise ship, but I actually think it's a little bit better because the whole fact that it does have a full interior and it's not like a bunch of dead areas in the middle of the ship. Now you're gonna notice that it's running in slow-mo right now and that's because we are really close to the dock. So I'm gonna get up to the wheelhouse and we are gonna pull away and we're gonna have an epic sink here today. So if you guys are enjoying Stormworks on the channel, you know what to do, hit that thumbs up button and uh, let's proceed. All right, so we are moving. We got the engine fired up here. You fired up at this screen. Uh, we will turn on all the lights here in a minute. I think those are them right there. I want to try to get away from the land masses, though. That way we can clear up the lag just a little bit. Uh, it's not terrible, but it's definitely not great. Oh, it's actually running quite a bit better. Uh, I think it was the uh, the big dock there. But yeah, look at this thing. It's got some really awesome lifeboats uh, that we have the option to use on each side. It looks like they're all deployable, which is uh, something you don't see a whole lot of. Uh, so you could see just the amount of interior, including... Uh, some really cool exterior things like the pools, the hot tubs here. Oh, this is a fantastic ship. Now, one thing I noticed, the ship is really tall. And of course, most cruise ships are. Like, I don't know how this thing would handle like a tsunami or something. I feel like it would capsize. But say if you didn't want to do the capsizing, there are options for sinks here. Uh, there is, oh, actually, these are the bilge pumps. But over here to the right, you've got like a... Um, I think one explodes a uh, the engine, and then one just sinks it in a kind of a standard way. All right, as you can see, the lag cleared up a ton. Like, look at this. All right, so what happens when I start turning on lights, though? Uh, sometimes stuff gets laggy that way, but you know what? We're doing it. We're going for all the lights. Uh, yeah, still feels pretty good. All right, so let me make sure. Looks like we're angled pretty decent here. I don't think we're going to run into anything. Maybe I'll turn a little bit to the right. Uh, there we go. Okay, about there. All right, so I'm gonna let it do its thing. Let's go ahead and go on a bit of a tour while you don't we? All right, so looks like we're probably where, I would imagine this to be where like the uh, the crew might be sleeping. This is right behind the bridge. Uh, you got TVs in here. Doesn't look like those TVs work unless it's the switch on the wall. Hold on, what's this? Oh, there's a circuit breaker in here. Nope, still doesn't look like it's working. Uh, at least you have the lights so yeah really nice cabins uh you got like a nice view out here uh over here this is potentially an elevator i don't know i think i might have just called something here let's hit push buttons on both sides uh it's doing something i don't know we'll uh, come back to that so yeah more cabins through here we're gonna walk out to oh that is beautiful that is epic oh it was an elevator you can see the elevator going up right now uh let's go take it real quick so yeah, the workshop creator said this was their uh, first ship to actually put on the workshop, and it is glorious. So we'll start down in the lobby. Let's go and click the button. Look at this. But man, that is a view and a half here. I want to go to this ship. Also, there's a nice little bar down here. All right, we are arriving in the lobby. So this opens up. Looks like we got a theater over here. Uh, we can go into this area. I think this is like a little gift shop. Yeah, uh, sh uh, shore excursions. Oh, that would probably be where you uh, get ready to go out. Say they uh, dock at like an island or something. You can go do some fun stuff. Uh, looks like we have guest services over there. Here's your bar. I'm assuming these are probably cabins in here. Uh, oh, yeah. Look at these. They even have like little bathrooms and stuff. This is such a neat ship. This might be one of my new favorite ships on the workshop. It is incredible. All right, so here's a quick look at the inner cabins. These are the ones that don't have the uh, windows. Uh, just give you guys a little look at those. So that's cabins all the way down there. Uh, what if we go this way? What do we have? We have... Okay, that's the theater. 
Uh, let's go up to the next uh, floor here. I don't know. There might have been something towards the very rear of the ship. Uh, looks like there's a casino over here. Uh, we got that. We have... This is the top balcony for the theater. Uh, very cool to see. So yeah, we can walk back here. Here's the casino. We have uh, some slot machines. We can turn these on. Oh, look at that. Oh, okay, I don't think I can stare at that too long. Uh, you got like a little bar here. Uh, we can go back here to the back. This leads out to the... Oh, I think it's the name. It's Carnival uh, Festival. Uh, we got a staircase here. This leads back into... Oh, look at this dining area. So, I think the guest cabins might have led back to here too. You got like a huge dining area. There's a bar down there. You've got a stunning view out the back here. Oh, this is amazing. Uh, so you've got that. This is... Would this be access to the lifeboats? Uh, hold on. Click it. Why? Well, here's something opening. Hold on. Click it again. Uh, throttle lever. What is this? Oh, so that's a lock. Okay, so that's neat. This is how you get to the lifeboats. So this is good to know for when we go through our sink here. Uh, so we're passing by an oil rig. Uh, yeah, I like this. Uh, let's go ahead and seal this back off, though. So let's go boom. And we will lock it. All right. Look at this. I even think we have uh, separate elevators here. Looks like we have elevators on the side. Uh, this is not the main one. Uh, here, let's go ahead and walk up a floor. So this leads into... Looks like just a nice little setting area. You got like a little stage up here. Does this screen work? Oh, uh, it's like a couple lights. Maybe like a comedy club or something. Uh, that's pretty cool. And then we can walk uh, back through here. Uh, looks like we've got like another little theater area. Uh, we'll go out on the deck here in a second. Looks like more bar areas. A lot of little restaurants on here. This is cool. So does that mean there's something different on this side? So yeah, on this side, looks like you got some uh, overview areas. Uh, maybe like a restaurant over here. Oh, it's the Red Frog Pub. Oh, that's neat. Uh, you got cherry on top, probably like an ice cream shop. All right, so we are on, are we on three? I think we're on three. Let's go up to four. Uh, here we go. So this would be where we started. I feel like we're missing something. Uh, we definitely probably want to walk further out. You know, maybe these are suites. Uh, well, I wouldn't say those rooms are that much bigger. Uh, maybe the crew goes somewhere else. And Oh, look at this. This is cool. So, yeah, here's one of the pools. I think there's more pools on the back. You got, like, little showers here. Uh, we're not going to run into anything, are we? No, we look clear. So, yeah, you've got those. You've got, like, little, uh, oh, guys, burger joint. So, food areas here. Oh, let's go up to here, and then we could probably go around the back. And Oh, look, they have the little water slide and stuff up here. Oh, that's cool. All right, so we can go back here. There's more areas to sit down. Looks like this would be like a little bowling alley and like a pool table. Or maybe this leads down to like a game room or something. Uh, I think that's what this is. So, yeah, we can walk through here. Yeah, I don't normally like to keep these tours of the ships very long. But, I mean, there's just so much cool stuff to check out. Like, I was telling you guys, this is one of my favorite ships now. The interior is incredible. So yeah, just kind of zooming around, uh, just to give you guys a couple more views of stuff that we might have missed. You can see, like, these little outdoors uh, seating areas. There's where the, uh, the lifeboats are. Uh, you've got more, like, outdoor buffets on this side. Uh, you got more seating over here. I like that it's not just, like, mirrored from side to side. Like, there's different stuff on each side of the ship. Uh, you got some seating in the front. And then we can cruise down to here. Is there anything below? Okay, so I think the bottom of the ship might actually be empty. Where does this lead to? Oh. Uh, I'm not sure what this is down here. It looks like we can launch. Maybe there's some more lifeboat systems down here. There's like a whole storage area, it looks like, down in the bottom. All right, so that's definitely something that we did miss. So, yeah, I think for the most part we have covered the ship, but we are ready for the moment you guys have been waiting for. All right, so we are set and we're ready to go. Let's go ahead and see what this ship can take. Ah, that's more like it. So the old Carnival Cruise is going to run into a bit of a storm here. Holy man. Okay, uh, the roll stabilizers are on. Um, what's the indicator lights for? Uh, also, there's a poor little ship out in front of us. Okay, counter it. Ooh, I don't know if this thing would make it uh, during a tsunami. Uh, it seems to kind of stabilized out, though. That's not bad. Wait a minute. Uh, we got doors that are open on the side. Hold on, let's try to navigate the ship while it's listing. 
Yeah, down in, I want to say it's the very bottom. All right, let's go ahead and close these real quick. We need to seal this up, and there we go. All right, so we have sealed the ship. We're actually, uh, I feels like we're leaned back up. Like, it doesn't feel bad at all. All right, so we are back in the bridge. It is starting to get dark. As you can see, the ship is pretty much fully illuminated. You've got to be kidding me. There was a door open on the other side, too. Oh, it's sealed. Oh, you know what? Just the ramp itself didn't go up. I wonder how you make that go up. All right, well, let's keep an eye out here. Looks like we got a wind turbine up ahead of us. We're going to turn a little to the left. We want to try to get out to open sea here. Uh, okay, what? I got to see what that red indicator light is for. Is that just showing on which side we're listing on, or what is that doing for us? Oh, keep going, keep going, keep going. Yeah, these waves are pretty killer right now. This might end up being a night sink. Okay, let it stabilize. All right, so what is this? Oh, forward compartment overflow. Wait, does that mean we're taking on water? Huh? That is a good question. Also, do we have all the lights on? I gotta make sure we have all deck lights on. I thought I turned them all on. It looks like the front might not be all the way lit up. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and turn on our emergency lights real quick. Uh, make sure everything's illuminated. And we're just gonna try to weather the storm here. What's this? Oh, it's just like a little weather thing. It says it's storming. All right, we're gonna do a little uh, check of the ship. We just wanna ensure that everything is sealed off. Uh, yeah, like I said, that one little uh, warning sign, it has me a little afraid. Oh, I didn't realize there wasn't a door. Is there not a door here? There's a frame here. So, yeah, if you would have capsized, Watcher could get in through this top. All right, here, let's start to go down. Uh, probably want to head towards that crew area. Uh, did we go through here? That was the sushi place. It's kind of an odd time to notice that, but yeah, <laughs> that's a thing. All right, let's just go backstage here. Uh, okay, let's get our flashlight out. There we go. All right, so what are we dealing with down here? Look both ways. Okay, we're clear here. Let's head down this hall. Uh, what is this? Is this where the ship's put together? It might be. Uh, it's a door frame down there. All right, what do we have back here? Okay, so... I don't know what those are supposed to be. It's like little ramps. Okay, here's... Oh, we're actually heading back towards the engine room. Okay, this is where the firefighting equipment is. Uh, this is where the engine is, I'm assuming. Oh, here we go. Uh, let's turn on the center console. Like I said, we're not uh, running right now. That way we're not overheating. Hotel power failure. Compartment... Wait. What is overflowing? Uh, flood. There's... Okay, there's something flooded. I may need to turn on those bilge pumps. Where does this go? Uh, okay, so here are your engines in the engine room. Okay, so uh, it looks like we're fine right now. I'm not noticing any water down here. So here, let's go ahead and head up. Oh, uh, wait, where does this go? Oh, you know what? That might be outside. We might not want to go there. All right, here, let's head back up. All right, we have been setting here for quite a while. I think we're going to go ahead and uh, start back up and maybe start heading back towards the islands uh, because we've been stranded out here. I've actually let the boat sit just to see how long it could take on these waves. And it might also be... Oh, jeez. Oh, okay. That's, that's a big one. All right, and come down. There we go. But yeah, I was just trying to see how long it would take some of these waves, and it's doing a great job, like, for how tall it is. But I think it's time to fire this bad boy back up, and let me get to the bridge. It is hard to walk up the stairs. We might should take the elevators. This is fine. All right, we are back in the bridge. Storm is subsiding a little bit. Let's go ahead and throttle back up and shift gears. All right, so we should be able to head towards the islands now. Yeah, I must say, I'm rather impressed. I feel like in order to get this thing to go down, you're either going to have to click the buttons or, you know what, we might try something else. We're going to turn the ship here, and we're probably going to let a tsunami hit it uh, to see if we can get any sort of sink. But right now, it's holding up really good. All right, there it is. We have a mighty tsunami on the way. Will this really tall ship be able to handle it? I kind of feel like it would be able to. Also, is there a ship way over there? I see lights going up the tsunami. Oh, that was a big boy. Uh, okay, 
Well, I guess it's gonna be our turn here. Let's start the turn. Uh, we'll see if we're gonna make it. All right, here it goes. Oh, come on. Uh, let's see if it's gonna tip. It is. Oh, it's going over. Uh-oh. Uh, question is, does it go back over all the way? Actually, oh, <laughs> I don't think a cruise ship's supposed to look like this. Uh, this is fine. Oh, it's going back this way. Uh-oh. Uh, is it gonna tip back over? Holy man, that's cool looking. Uh, okay, so we've drained all the water out of the uh, pools, but it's coming back up. Look at that. It did it like a champ. This might be unsinkable. What? All right, folks, we're heading to the rear of the ship. I could have swore I just heard an explosion noise. <gasps> Look, uh, the heat reading is going up. Uh-oh. Uh, I wonder if the poor little engines couldn't hold up to the, uh, the extreme pressure of the storm. Hold on, look down. Uh, we need to get over to the engine room ASAP. Oh, dear. Uh, see, crew area. It was somewhere over here, wasn't it? Uh, maybe further down. Hold on, let's go down this way. Okay, look for crew. Oh. Look how bright it is. In oh, that is definitely fire. Okay, uh, let's see. There was firefighting equipment. Let's go down this way. Uh-oh. Um... Folks, we are taking on water. Uh, we probably need to go hit that bilge. Hold on. We need to try to fight this fire a little bit, at least. See if we can extinguish it. And oh, man. This whole thing exploded in here. All right. Start spraying. Wait, we got a hose, don't we? Uh, oh. Okay, we got to be mindful. Make sure we don't get trapped down here. We got to fight this fire a little bit. Uh, okay, equip this. Attach. Actually, get the firefighting equipment on here. Okay, so we want to get the hose. And we want to attach this. Uh, let's go boom okay oh that is uh filling up quick uh wait why can i not go f that far with this oh there it goes okay uh let's toggle it there it goes okay we're gonna try to fight the engine fires a little bit see if we can put these out uh, i don't want it to crash my game uh, that's definitely a thing if you get too much fire especially a ship this big it might crash all right start spray keep spraying spray up a little bit uh, we are fighting engine fires aboard this ship. On, oh, we're actually doing a, a decent job, I think. I'll uh, start spraying this middle section. Okay, spray towards the back. Oh, uh, oh dear. Uh, okay, we are getting a little close here. On, uh, look behind us. Okay, we're good. Let's try to make sure the water hasn't risen too high in here. We need to be able to escape. Uh, of course, it's going to probably put itself out eventually, but uh, I want to try to keep it from spreading uh, too far up. Okay, come on. Spray back over here. Uh, oh no, it might have already spread. I don't see any more fire sources down here. Uh, does that mean it's up above us? There's a potential it's up above us now. That's really not good. Okay, come on, jump up here. Spray across a little bit more. Okay, we gotta drop it. Okay, let's go. Okay, we got fire up in these compartments. Uh, wait, do I still have the hose? Why does it say I still have that? Okay. Uh, I should have grabbed a extinguisher. Let's see if we can fight it with one of those. Uh, okay. Grab extinguisher. No, 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 no. Drop. Drop this. I don't need this. I need this. Okay. Let's head back up. We are definitely taking on a lot of water. We're going to have to get the lifeboats ready. Okay. Let's see. Where's the fire spreading? Okay. So it's in the dining room right now. Uh, can we fight this? Oh, geez. Okay. Start trying to spray across here. Oh, it's definitely on the outside of the ship. Whoa, wait. We are leaning really bad. Uh, okay, you know what? Drop this. Uh, I think it's time to go. All right, run across. Okay, we got to go up. Uh, oh, duck down. Come on. Oh, jeez. Okay, that is rushing up really quick. Uh, I don't think you want to use the elevator right now. If we get stuck in an elevator, that would be a horrible way to die. Okay, where are the lifeboats? Was it this area? Okay, actually, I think it's this way. Okay, go up this. All right, so we want to circle around. Uh, we got to get to those lifeboats real quick. Okay, look for the exit signs. Uh, exit, exit. Oh, here we go. Actually, no, it's definitely... Oh. Oh, that is a lot of water. Oh, no, it's coming through these. Okay, so the water line is up over... Oh, uh-oh. 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 Okay, get out of that. Uh, I hear alarms going off. Oh, this is terrible. Uh, are the lifeboats covered? Why do I not remember where these exactly are? I think they're below this. They're already covered, aren't they? Okay. Uh, we need to go because this is filling up 
super quick. Look at the water line just rising. Holy man. Why am I still watching this? That is crazy. Okay, time to run. Uh, run, 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 run. Oh, look, the water's going up. Okay, go, 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 go. Go to the rear of the ship. Is there another set of lifeboats? Uh, I don't think so. Can we, we can't release those, can we? Uh, we are completely screwed. Oh, yeah, and the back of the ship's on fire. No, that's great. Um, where does this go? That's a cabin. Uh, does the cabin have a door that opens? Can we get out that? Okay, come on. Please tell me that. Okay, that does open. Oh, jeez. Okay. Uh, no, go this way. Oh, oh, it's going down quick. Okay, don't get under the canopy. No, 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 no. I can't jump. Oh, that water. No, oh, okay. This is bad. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Okay, swim. Swim, swim. Get out from under it. Oh, okay. Jeez. Wait, what the heck? Where'd that ship come from? Um, It's going down. That thing went down so quick. When it decided to go... It went. Did it just touch the bottom of the ocean? There's a chance it just did. Uh, oh, never mind. There it goes. Wow. That was a close call. We just escaped that thing. That was insane. That is probably one of my favorite things in a long time. Well, we tried. At least we have a boat over here that, you know, they probably, if they weren't stupid AI, they would stop and be like, hey, you need some assistance? Uh, we got kind of lucky there. But anyways, go check out the ship in the description. We'll see you guys next time.